Hello everyone, this is Jozef Nagy here and welcome to the first edition of 2022's CFT Summer series where I am going to talk about some community activities that I've been involved in in the last year since the last CFT Summer series so let's talk about that. So and what I want to concentrate on in this video is the open foam journal that started last year and it gained momentum last year and this year now it's an ongoing project. So if you haven't heard about it, there is the open foam journal. You can look at it by typing in journal.openfoam.com and then you can press enter. And as you can see, this is the landing page. It is a very simplistic landing page for a reason, because we don't want to sell anything to you. We want to provide you with free um, uh, publications, which are also so, so it's free to publish and also free to access. So all you have to do is, yeah, may, maybe you, uh, you can click on current or archives. Here you have both volumes, so last year's volume and this year's volume, and there are already a couple of published papers in it. And uh, we always get the, uh, the questions, when do we release an issue? So an issue is immediately uh, opened at uh, the beginning of January in a year, and then the moment a uh, manuscript is accepted, then it will be immediately added to the issue and immediately online. So there is no waiting period for publishment, uh, publishing because we do not deliver these in paper we it is a fully electronic and you can click on the publications take a look at the extract yeah, we have an associated discussion forum on cfd online where you can ask questions to the authors and uh, you can also download the pdf and also case files and also source code if the um, authors provide source code so you can download every, uh, everything here free to access and it is a very successful uh, journal so I just wanted to show you I am one of the editors so I have the view behind the scenes so just to show you the, the statistics of some of the the publications here so the abstracts were uh, the abstract of this publication was accessed 2217 times the file is uh, so the pdf was ac downloaded once over 1000 times in a year so it is um it isn't very nice statistics for a community for an open form uh, related journal so please consider submitting there because um most of the community will take a look at it and will have access to your work. And it is a w very nice way to have um, your publications get out to the, uh, to the community. We get the question, uh, it's not here. So we do have publication details here. Yes, yeah, so we have an ISSN number as well as DOI and indexing will we will apply for indexing in something like scopus or something like that but for that uh, a certain amount of time has to pass between the establishment of the journal and the um, apl application for indexing and this is has not um, um, transpired yet so next year is i think when we will be able to apply for indexing and in scopus and so on but for that we need publications so please consider it because it is um, so the open form journal is shaping to be a uh, full um, a scientific journal in the upcoming years or year or years so please be one of the first ones to publish here Okay, so this is one of the aspects that I wanted to talk to you. The other one is that the Open Form Journal has its YouTube channel, which I personally set up. And uh, there, there are two uh, videos on the template, how to use the templates that we provide for the Open Form Journal. And most interestingly, we also have the videos first from last year's open form workshop and from this year's open form workshop from the cambridge workshop there are 
all the sessions available. So there is a full playlist where you can watch all of the videos. There is a playlist with only the splash talks, then only the training sessions, the regular sessions and the keynote sessions you can take a look at. So if you take a look at all the videos that are available, I just counted, there are over 110 videos already available, some of them over an hour long. So there are over a hundred uh, hours of worth of viewing content on this channel already now. It just launched this year. So there are very exciting things to, um, to look at. And if you have, were, were not able to attend any of the workshops or you were able to attend, but you forgot something and you want to review the, the talks that you really liked at those workshops, then you can go to YouTube, to the YouTube channel of the Open Form Journal and just rewatch the talks. So a very exciting thing. And I, I think this is very, very cool uh, ju just for, to access all the, the talks that were given at the workshops. So that was what I wanted to talk to you about in this CFD summer uh, video. Uh, I hope that uh, you will watch the next one as well. So with that, I would like to uh, thank you for watching and listening. And I hope to see you next time.